Yesterday, I learned from Sawyer Merritt's Twitter channel that every Tesla model produced after November 1 will be marked as 2022 model year. And I asked Sawyer, what, was, what does that mean? And uh, so, so far, I haven't heard from him, but it looks like Electric is reporting that Tesla is increasing Model 3 and Model Y ranges with the 2022 model year. Welcome back, friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel and give us thumbs up for this report if you like this report and find it informative so tesla has updated model 3 and model y ranges with the 2022 model year and most of them got higher ranges though it depends on the wheels electric notes in an overnight update to its online configurator tesla changed the ranges of several of its most popular model 3 and model y dreams the update seems to coincide with tesla shifting to the 2022 model year starting November 1. Model years are not as big of a deal with Tesla as it is with most other car makers since the electric automaker doesn't wait for a new model year to implement changes in its vehicles thanks to its over-the-air updates and some other info programs that it has. It continuously introduces new features and changes throughout the year as they are ready for production. And like I said, most of them are happening through the over-the-air uh, updates. However, some model years can coincide with bigger changes. For the 2022 model year, Tesla appears to have made changes that affected the range of Model 3 and Model Y vehicles. For the Model 3 Standard Range Plus, the range went from 262 to 272 miles on a single charge so the owners will get extra 10 miles of range that's on the standard 18 wheels which are only standard in price as in cheaper because um, uh, in, because tesla now has the 19 inch wheels selected by default on the online configurator with the 19 wheels the range falls to 267 miles also tesla doesn't seem to refer to the base model 3 as a standard range plus now it only refers to it as rear wheel drive and the different battery packs are only differentiated by the model 3 dual motor also being called long range speaking of the model 3 long range it goes from 353 to 358 miles with the 18 inch wheels with 19 wheels the range goes down to 334 miles on a single charge the model y long range also got a bump it went from 320 26 to 330 miles of range that's on the smaller 19 inch wheels as the 20 inch reduces efficiency resulting in 318 miles of range it's not clear what changes have led to the updated range however asks electric uh, but notes that when it comes to the model 3 standard range which is not being called standard range anymore tesla recently announced that it is moving all standard range vehicles to electric FP batteries. It could explain the change. We will update if we get more information. So please subscribe to our channel, friends, for daily Tesla news and ring the bell, uh, the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla coverage. And uh, this is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. Have a great day. Peace be with all of you. God be with you, friends. Blessings. And uh, let's move on to the next Tesla story. One of the big stories yesterday about Tesla was that Tesla is inking a three-year lithium deal with with one of the largest lithium producers in the world, Gafeng, uh, to advance its 4680 new batteries for Tesla electric vehicles. But there was another news in the past two days that kind of went unnoticed. Tesla is going to buy 45 gigawatt hour of LFP batteries from Cattle. Tesla and Cattle have struck a deal for 45 gigawatt hour of LFP batteries and are talking about even more. Welcome back, friends. This is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. If you are here first time, please subscribe to our channel for daily tesla news ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage and give us thumbs up please for this report we would greatly appreciate it steve henley from clean technica has noted that uh, citing the 36kr chinese website cnev post he says tesla actually reports the chinese website that tesla has agreed to buy 46 gigawatt hour of lithium iron phosphate batteries from cattle to meet its expected demand 
demand for the Model 3 and Model Y cars in 2022. The Model 3 and Model Y are currently available with LFP batteries in their standard range versions, with the former having a 55 kilowatt hour battery and the later a 60 kilowatt hour battery. The purchase will be enough to power about 800,000 vehicles. The company sold 627,350 electric cars in the first nine months of this year. Tesla Nevada battery factory will soon increase production to produce more than 40 gigawatt hour of batteries in 2022. And with additional supplies from Panasonic and LG Chem, Tesla's 2020 sales could be at least 1.5 million units, the 36KR report says, citing industry sources. That report claims that even as the new contract was being announced, Cattle and Tesla were in talks about increasing the order even further. Friends, LFP is rapidly becoming the chemistry of choice for medium and low price electric vehicles. Data released earlier this month by the China Automotive Battery Innovation Alliance showed that LFP battery installations in China have continued to grow in the past two months after surpassing ternary batteries for the first time this year in July. According to the data, China's battery installed base in September was 15.7 gigawatt hour up 138 percent uh, year on year and 25 percent from August. Among them, ternary batteries installed a total of 6.1 gigawatt hour up 46.6 percent year on year and up 15 percent from August. However, LFP battery installation volume increased even more with 9.5 gigawatt hour installed in September up 309 percent year on year and 32 percent compared with August. With uh, what to what do all these numbers mean? Simply this, says Clean Technica. The electric vehicle revolution is accelerating thanks in part to lower price and improved performance for lithium iron phosphate batteries. Going forward, NMC and other traditional lithium ion battery chemistries will be reserved for high end and or high performance electric vehicles. Most of us will be quite happy to drive a car that takes a blink of an eye longer to sprint to 60 miles per hour but costs considerably less to buy friends in my opinion also um, electric vehicle revolution will move on even further because new battery chemistries are coming new battery research is going on and things are going to get even more exciting well let me know what do you think about tesla buying 46 gigawatt hour of lfp batteries from cattle are you happy with lfp batteries and having higher batteries for the higher range and higher priced performance electric vehicles this is armin harian from torquenews.com Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla and electric vehicle batteries news and ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage. God bless you. Peace be with all of you friends. Be good to each other and let's move on to the next story.